hard work and their sacrifice and dedication to the theater program at Ridley, these candidates have earned the right to be called the best theater. The title of honor signifies a commitment to an art that was once humanity. I would now like to introduce to you to the current IPS officers of Troop 2103. We have Jamie Ellis, Troop Historian, Social Media Coordinator. We have Michael Gary. We have Michaela Strack, Troop Secretary, Zach Palomino, Troop Tech Officer, Adriana Pasoni, right, Troop Vice President. I like to say this after me. I can't say it's not really good. And then Violet Riley, our Troop President. And these guys are going to be the ones who lead us through the ceremony this evening. They've done an amazing amount of work this year, um, making everything happen from the beginning, including our Track the State Conference, where we brought our play. Century, a man named Thespis, who was a prominent member of the Greek chorus, stepped forth and recited portions of the drama alone. Using masks to portray more than one part, he became the first actor. In honor of this early Greek playwright, all actors are called thespians, and our society is the International Thespian Society. We have our emblem, the two masks of comedy and tragedy, etched into colors of blue, gold, and bound together with the thespian tape. All inductees will receive a pin bearing this emblem and should keep the pin to wear at graduation ceremony. We would, first like, we would first like to induct the IPS members who have come tonight to adopt another generation into this established society. Would the current members of IPS please stand and be recognized? Performed five different musicals together. 
together. And though I haven't known this person as long, I've enjoyed getting to know them for the past two years. This person has been a part of the, uh, the most recent two musicals, those being Matilda the Musical and Anastasia. And outside of the drama group, they are also involved in concert choir, chamber choir, and rap. And outside of school, they perform as a singer at the School of Rock, and in the summer, they do a theater program called the Ridley Performing Arts Program. They are one of the most genuine people I know, and honestly, they, they can't stop making me laugh. They're one of the kindest people. That's why we are honored to induct Lily Lily Crawford. Crawford. This person is always wonderful to be around. They're constantly looking for something new to learn to develop their considerable technical skills, be it here at RDG or over at the Rhythm Performing Arts Program. They're incredible at the critical tasks they've been given, and they're always willing to put in an extra hour or two to learn something new. This person, this person has always been a bright light in RDG. His determination and perseverance is something to be envied. At times, he even juggled two shows at the same time. His hard work may go unnoticed, but truly the shows would not be what they are without him. We're proud to induct Angela Nieves. Thank you. 
This next inductee was excited and prepared to work with Ridley Drama Group on day one. They started a spotlight for the play that goes wrong, for the play that goes wrong, as well as participating in Tech Challenge at State Conference, placing first in the cable relay. This person was tasked with one of the toughest technical duties as a freshman and proved resilient throughout. They pushed through long and tiring hours of troubleshooting and receiving instructions, with them surviving off Wawa chicken quesadillas and monster energy drinks. <laughs> As if sitting backstage alone in her little corner to do projection wasn't enough. She was also my personal hairdresser, and she did a pretty good job, if I do say so myself, because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Today is also this inductee's 15th birthday. It is my honor to induct this person into ITS Troop 2103. Congratulations, and happy birthday, Claire Weber. <laughs> Special people I've ever met. 
Um, when I first met them sophomore year, we always spent like every day together um, in gym class, walking around the track and tossing possibly one too many jokes um, with Gabby. They lead up any room they step into and can make you laugh at the best and worst of times. They're the sweetest and most caring people and truly a joy to be around. From being backstage to being in the dressing room, should never fail to make you smile. I'm so glad they decided to join the job group and I'm so proud of all they have done and will continue to do. My name is Gabby DeLuca and I'm honored to be inducting a very good friend of mine, Sophia. I've known this person for quite a while now. Ever since sixth grade homeroom, I always thought she was so pretty and thought her last name was so cool. I was low-key scared to go up and make a new friend. Fast forward to sophomore year, I ended up becoming friends with this person. She is one of the funniest people I know. She'll be real with you and always listen when you want to rant. She is so kind and will always have your back. I am so glad she joined RDG because that meant more memories with my favorite people in high school. We would like to congratulate <laughs> Jess is out in the idea. <laughs> She somehow juggles all those activities and manages and still manages outstanding grades in her honors and AP studies. She has amazing personality and brings so much joy to others around her, even if God thinks she ought to smile. Without further ado, we are proud to induct Emma Dernay. I'm so thankful for all the kindness and love that she brings to RDG, and I'm glad the drama group has brought us even closer than before. 
I wouldn't even trade the late work nights spent together and even later nights driving to drop her off afterwards for the world. Congratulations to one of our best friends, Dulce! During their four years 
Pacific High School ITS members have the opportunity to participate in many different activities, fundraisers, educational experiences, and theatrical productions to earn additional points above the points needed for induction. At graduation, these distinctions and achievements are signified on the graduation robe with a gold star and honor bar pins and ribbons. To earn a national honor bar, a student must have earned an additional 120 points. To earn an honor bar, a student must have earned an additional 60 points. And to earn one star, a student must have earned an additional 10 points. We would like to congratulate the following seniors of ITS on their achievements by recognizing their achieved stars and bars. With one additional star, Mia Rudder, Connor Murder, Sophia Kelleher, and Sophia Fiore. With two additional stars, Kayleen Park, Laura Hendry, Gabriella DeLuca. With four additional stars, Michaela Strack and Adriana Petulis. With one honor bar and one star, Violet White. dedication and passion over the last four years. At this time, we'll have the presentation of senior awards by Park President and Sir Rob Gaddis. Hello. Uh, the Parent Association of Ridley Thespians uh, has two awards each year. Uh, presented to students in the drama group. These awards are over both cast and crew. Student chosen, students chosen will possess the following qualities. Good leadership, pleasant, polite, willingness to help his or her fellow students and the parents involved in part. These students are loved by their fellow drama students and will do anything that was needed for the program. The first award tonight is presented to a young man who's been a member of the Ridley Drama crew for the last two years. He's a member of the International Peasant Society been operating at the A2 for the last three RDG productions, Matilda, Play That Goes Wrong, and Anastasia. This student finds himself very busy during prom season as he works at Ridging Rainbow Forest and Ayabushi Tuxedo Rental. In the fall, he plans to attend Wider University where he will study business. Please join me in congratulating the winner of the 2020-2024 Park <laughs> Award to Ryan Ritz. <laughs> The second award is presented to an RDG member who has been a member of the cast for two years. This student has been a part of two RDG productions. They were in the ensemble for Matilda and Anastasia and also performed as Count Apolitoff in Anastasia. Outside of the drama, the student is in concert choir, chamber choir, and rhapsody. They plan to attend Delaware County Community College this fall with hopes of eventually transferring to a university in either New York or Philadelphia to study musical theater and dance. Please join me in congratulating the winner of the 2024 Art Award to Cody Boone. I am now going to ask uh, Mike Bernard to come forward and present the next award. Kara Barnard Memorial Stage Crew Award. Each year, the Kara Barnard Stage Crew Memorial Award, given in memory of Kara Barnard, whose son was a dedicated member of RDG Stage Crew, 
when she passed away, will be given to a, a senior RDG stage crew member. This award is presented to a student who possesses the following qualities. Reliable, dedicated, polite crew member, demonstrating initiative and always willing to assist his or her fellow students, directors, volunteers, and the park parents. The winner of the award for 2024 has been a dedicated stage crew member for the last two years. She has played a huge role in the success of some of RDG's largest productions, like Matilda, The Play That Goes Wrong, and the 2024 blockbuster, Hit Anastasia. Outside of her, spent, outside of her time spent with RDG, this student was a four-year player on the Ridley soccer team, as well as captain this year. She is a member of the National Honor Society, Leo Club, and a peer mentor. Outside of RHS, she works at Urban Air as a party host. After graduation from Ridley High, this young woman plans to attend Westchester University, go Rams, where she will major in early education. Please join me in congratulating the winner of the 2024 Cara State Cara Barnard Stage Crew Award to Sydney D. <laughs> Countless students learned the intricacies 
of sound production and found their passion for the craft. Eric believed in nurturing, nurturing young talent and supporting, teaching tech-savvy individuals how to master the art of live audio. And his influence echoes through these halls. Today, as we honor Eric's memory with the establishment of the Eric and Eisenman Memorial Scholarship, we recognize a student that embodies the values he held dear. This year's recipient has experienced every facet of the audio tech within our group. Starting as an A2 for ELF, progressing to become a sound cue operator for Clue, and ultimately serving as a student sound engineer for productions of 12 Angry Turners, Matilda, The Play That Goes Wrong, and Anastasia. The student stands out not only for their technical prowess, but also their unwavering dedication and leadership within our tech group. With, with a sharp wit and determination, they have been an integral part of the Ridley job group. But their involvement doesn't end there. They are a dedicated member of various organizations within and outside of school, showcasing their commitment and excellence in all their endeavors. It is with great pride that we present the inaugural Eric Eisenman Memorial Scholarship to Katie Park.
The Outstanding Thespian Award is presented every year to a student who's active in both Ridley Drop Group and ITS Troop 2103 and shows exemplary leadership skills on and off the stage. As a member of ITS, students must participate in outside fundraising and social events that develop rapport and encourage team building. The Outstanding Thespian is a student who's shown themselves to be responsible, rational, hardworking, communicative, and who leads by example with a cool head capable of creating problem solving. The recipient of this award has been a member of RDG for three years, attended PA State conferences, worked as a technician and stage manager, and participated in all fundraisers and activities, including managing work nights. In addition to her commitment to RDG, she also played tennis, becoming captain in her senior year, cheer, participated in concert choir, chamber choir, rhapsody, and was inducted into the National Honor Society and Triumph Music Honor Society. It is no wonder that she was voted best new inductee in her induction year. The season, she crossed the line from tech into cast and took her first ever musical, uh, took on her first ever musical where she played the lead role and pushed herself far past her limits to acquire an additional set of skills while also retaining many of the jobs and responsibilities that she had before. Watching this transition and the growth that came from it was truly magical and proved that in a place like RPG, with the support of the team around us, anything is possible. Next year, she will pursue an education in cosmetology as she continues to work at the Bay Salon. The recipient of the Outstanding Thespian Award is Gabriella. Church. In addition to all of this, 
This student is also just one of the nicest people you ever meet. Her professionalism is unparalleled. We will miss her calm, capable presence in the group and the house. And she plans to major next year in environmental engineering, where her skills and talents will surely be on display. This year's first recipient of the Kirk Call Award is Laura Henry. Similar 
winning a Philadelphia Independence Award and showing that her artistic and dramatic talents are far-reaching and diverse. As president of ITS, she led a group of students through two successful shows, one of which we brought to PA State Conference. This year, she also shared her time and expertise with musical theater and drama students as an intern. She's an academically talented student, a member of the Concert Choir, Chamber Choir, Rhapsody, Mock Trial, Tri M Honor Society, a National Honor Society, when she's not working for RDG and ITS. I am not entirely sure how she pulled all of this off, but I know that we were extremely lucky to have such a person in our midst and to benefit from her insane work ethic and amazing raw talent. I know the student will continue to wow us in the future as she pursues a musical theater major next year. It is my honor to award the David Miller Memorial Scholarship to Violet Twilight. Jamie Elk. The ITS 
officers work incredibly hard. I'm very proud of this group. And um, there's enormous opportunity for anybody who wants to become leadership in RDG. There are so many minutes you could spend with us. So many minutes, right? So don't be afraid, right, to get involved, right, and to come in and to, right, get to know everybody and spend your time here at Comsu. It'll be one of the most interesting and also rewarding experiences of your high school career. Um, I think at our banquet, it was pretty evident that that was true for many people, and I think that that those are the people that like got involved, right, and came in and did all of those things. So don't be afraid, continue to do it, um, and welcome to everybody who's new at the ITS. It's going to be a really fun and amazing year next year. This concludes the 2024 International Thespian Society induction ceremony. Thank you for watching and for your continued support of the arts at Ridley. Your appreciation of the students' accomplishments and support with our program serves to strengthen not only our school community, but our society at large, and we are so grateful. Thank you. If all of the ITS members could go to the stage for a photograph, Mrs. Geddes will be doing her customary stand on the chair. Good job.